The Viridian expansion dropped yesterday, and with it came new Homefront combat sites in high sec. These sites present various scenarios that require teamwork in different fleet roles in order to complete. A great way for more experienced players to bring new bros up to speed. The raid site, for example, supposedly requires a mixture of fleet roles from DPS and tackle to haulers that move bulky loot over to the NPC freighter to complete the site. Within the first day, however, players had optimised the strategy to do away with the hauler by dropping a mobile tractor unit on the freighter. This allowed them to just drag and drop the loot. CCP responded on day two, making the hauler X immune to tractor beams. But we can't let CCP win that easily, right? I'm using two Vex and Navy issues. The enemies jam so much that drones make things a lot easier, and having at least two ships mean I can maintain tackle on the hauler whenever the NPC jams land. Simply jettison some spare ammo, then scoop the hauler loot into the jet can. Don't shoot your jet can like I did. We need to loot three haulers to complete the site, so just rinse and repeat. Do away with the MTU completely and use a tractor beam to tow a jet can around with you. The slowest part of running the site will be flying over to the freighter to hand in the loot so consider adding a Noctis to your little fleet. Sit the Noctis on the freighter to pull in the jet cans and speed things up. The rewards in the home front sites also scale depending on the fleet size. A fleet of 5 players would be optimal. 4 Vex and Navy issues and a Noctis would make this stupid fast. 17 million isk each for maybe 3 or 4 minutes in the site. Grab some new players and make their day by fattening up their wallets. Hopefully you found this video useful. Your move CCP. Oh, and leave a comment for a chance to win a Stratia Scope Syndication skin. Cheers.